Hello Vikings and welcome back to another Assassin's Creed Valhalla video. So, Valkyrie's dirty work, aka avenging another player's death. With Skull Crusher and Sunny Strike, they are our week 52 of 2021's weekly Ubisoft Connect challenges. And I'm here to help you out. I'm gonna show where and how to do them. So, let's go! This place is heavily guarded. Let's start with the Avenge quest. So, Come in East Anglia at the Scotho farm, south from the ruined tower here on the map. And yes, this is the very first place where we did get the Avenge quest so many months ago. And I was one of the first and I told Joraptor about this place and he even gave me a shout out. So shout out to you bro. In this place you need to go in the well on the roof and wait. Also the enemies are shouting out Eivor. So I did this on the top of the roof without killing anybody. I waited exactly or around 10 minutes on the roof and yes we are on speed mode at the moment. Exactly 8 times faster than other clips in this video. So just wait, wait, undetected is better. Of course if that is not working restart the game, come here or you can even try to die as we did in the first time. So. I will say easiest way is setting your game on very hard difficulty, going into the fire and let the enemies kill you. Consider that as a fuel for the Owens quest, so if we are dying there is something to Owens and that actually did work pretty fine last time. So feel free to try and let me know in the comments down below did it work. So this might actually take up to 10 to 15 even 20 minutes but eventually you will get the quest. What have we here? And usually Eivor is saying something for me in this one. What do we have here? And yes, we have something here. And that something is done, done, done. The Avenge quest. So let's get it. Also, if this is not working for you, just restart your game. Try dying. Wait 10 to 20 minutes. You can try to kill everybody in the camp or don't. Totally up to you. But I prefer being undetected the whole time. That way it has always worked for me. This time we are Ovenzing Domino, so thank you for dying here. While you are doing the Ovens quest you can actually do the Sinus Strike. So kills with Raven. What you need to do? You need to lower your enemy's health and then use Raven Distraction in order to make Sinin to perform the deadly finishing strike. I highly recommend of using light bow or hunter bow. Also on the melee, hammers, bearded axes and also six aka daggers that are making a little bit less damage so you can have the control how much damage is made to an enemy. On the shielded ones that has the wooden seals, yeah you can try to break it, not necessary or even easier melee damage. As a bonus, parrying will lower your enemy's stun bar, making it even more easier to do back damage and overall easier fights, little bit more damage overall after the stun bar or armor bar is down and then you just need to wait until your raven distraction skill or ability is recharged and of course you need at least one of your adherence slots filled and in my opinion easiest way is to collect the purple mushrooms or assassinating the targets. And no, the sleeping targets by using Throne of Slumber, that is not counting. So let's finish the Valkyrie's Dirty Work aka the Avenge Quest Challenge. After that I'm showing you few good spots as an example where you can finish the Skull Crusher Challenge where you need to kill bandits from England. And just like that, Domino has been avenged. It is time to kill the last guard and then to move on. And before anybody is asking, where do you get the Raven Distraction? Well, you get the first part from 
Donna Starrier, located in northwest of Leicestershire. And the funny thing, you get the second book of knowledge for Raven Destruction in Belesduna Bandit Camp, where you can actually do the Skull Crusher challenge. And from that place, going to the east, there is Brentwood Outpost, and that actually should count as well towards the challenge. So in Essex, Belesduna Bandit Camp, and from that place to the west, Brentwood Outpost. On the bonus, if you are just starting or looking into the game, little bit southeast from Ravenstorp, there is also a bandit camp. You can actually rank up like 14 to almost 20 bandits from that location alone. If that is not enough from Cloudcester, you can go north to Thieves Warren or to the west into the forest. And boom, easy, easy, easy as that. Doesn't matter how you kill them. Just and do it. Just for example sake, we are going to the bandit camp. Uh, let's do a few kills. Also, let me know, do you have any plans on New Year's? Are you playing the game? Are you gonna have a resolution for this year? And if you want to share, please do so in the comments down below. And of course, Happy New Year to everybody. So, let's do a few kills. After that, we are rolling the outro. So, Happy New Year to everybody for 2022. As always, this year was my pleasure and hope to see you in the next year. And huge thanks to all of you. Thanks for watching, remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload or when I go live. Also Vikings, have fun, stay safe, be strong, hope to see you in the next one, Skatha, over and up, and bye bye.